all the Purple Banditos, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. I'm Purple Rodri. Last time we ran around, we did a couple more things around here in Vermilion City. In today's episode, we're going to continue from this point and see if we can make our way to another town, explore around, mix it up, we'll see if we can do that. Now, in order to do this, we're actually going to have to backtrack. If you guys remember, we obtained HMO1 cut, I taught it to Bolin, and now with that, we can actually make our way back to Cerulean City and head out another way, another path. Hope you guys are having a nice day. Today has been all right for me. It is Sunday. It's a little bit slower. I always feel like Sundays are, you know, a little bit of slower days. I actually, you know, had my family come visit. They've kind of just been hanging out with me like I've mentioned to you guys earlier. It's just, it's nice to have a little company once in a while. You know, sometimes it's crazy. Like during the summer, I feel like a lot of people are away or a lot of people are gone. So sometimes, you know, you do get lonely and you have to find like things to keep yourself busy. I've definitely been there recently just trying to like, you know, figure out things to do to keep myself busy and to just, you know, keep my mind off of certain thoughts and just keep on going. And you know, one of the things that I've really found is, you know, having good friends, like no matter where they are. I've realized that, you know, going out and doing things with friends, like whether it's real life friends or playing games with online friends actually is very, very helpful if you're ever feeling lonely. It's strange, right? In such a wide world where we can connect with so many people, isn't it strange that like, we, even though we can chat pretty much to anyone around the world, we still do have moments where we feel lonely. You know, even like me, I definitely have to say, like, I have moments where I feel lonely. And it's strange because it's like, I have all of you guys, I have all friends, like, I have all, all these things going. But even at that, like, you can still feel lonely. All right, guys, we have a battle. Okay guys, so on that topic, we actually have a lot of battles coming up today, so I am going to be going fast through them. As I was saying, you know, sometimes if you feel lonely or whatever, I hope that if you guys like in a way watch my videos, I hope that you know that I care about you guys and that, you know, you shouldn't feel alone. Just know that like I'm here for you if you ever want to shoot me a tweet, I try to reply to all my messages and that sort of thing. So you know, don't feel like you're out there and you're all alone. There's always people that care about you. Whether it's me, whether it's friends, like your family, there's always someone out there, you know, and that's that's something that I've realized uh, kind of like, you know, the hard way. Uh, it took me a while to realize those sorts of things. And, you know, we live and we learn that sort of thing. So we're going through a weird path. As I said, we have a ton of battles to do today. I'm going to try to just get through them as fast as possible. And we have another one. Well then, Brinkar is sure pulling it out this time, like Brinkar is totally just tearing up all the trainers in this area. Now if you guys remember, the area that I mentioned that's going to be coming up is difficult, okay? It's another cave coming up and we're probably going to have like 10 or so battles in there which is ridiculous. One of the things that I'd like to tell you ahead of time is that you can actually obtain the HM Flash to make it easier. I don't get it because it really doesn't bother me I can pretty much just find my way through there plus it would mean having to pick up an HM slave and at this point I don't really think that would be too convenient but hey nurse joy did you check out my Nido King you know what I'm saying it's purple he's big you know what I'm saying nurse joy you you, you notice Doki you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying nurse joy Nido King all right well now that we're done with that our Pokemon are healed up and we are ready to enter this cave Oh man, this is gonna be ridiculous. This cave is actually pretty hard to maneuver through in the dark. I would recommend if it's your first time going through this cave, definitely get flash. As I kind of know where I'm going, I'm just gonna try to speed through it, the rock tunnel, as much as possible. So let's hope for the best, guys. We're also gonna have a lot of battles, like I said, and I will be speeding through through those too. One of the things I'm gonna recommend is stick to the walls. That will lead you to the ladders and hopefully make your way out. And with that, we have our first battle. Thank you. 
Not too shabby. Let's continue on then. There's a lot of creepy dudes hiding in here. Who would be the type of person that's a trainer that comes and hides in the dark just to attack little 10-year-old kids? I don't know. I, I personally wouldn't be that type of trainer. If I was a Pokemon trainer, I'd rather be in a gym or, uh, you know, a big open arena rather than hiding in some weird creepy cave. And I think we have another battle. These are coming a little too fast. I didn't think that there were going to be so many back to back to back to back to back. Oh, revive. Okay, finally. Maybe we'll actually start getting some soon. All right, there's battles all over this place. I don't even know what's going on around here. Finally, easy does it. All right, let's see. Maybe up here there's something. Ah. Oh. Once upon a time, there was this guy, and he was running through a cave. And then all of a sudden, as he was walking through slowly, he used a repel. And then he bumped into a big random looking... bearded guy who challenged him to battle okay guys i think we're actually about the halfway point so hopefully oh yeah there we go another ladder we'll be making it through here very soon uh, i think it's all the way down here if i saw correctly though we have a battle I feel like our team is so well-rounded. I can't wait to add the other three. I feel like the big three right here have just been helping us out so much that I'm kind of just excited to see what's coming up. Thanks to all you guys who actually left me suggestions. Uh, I read a lot of great team comps, and I think I'm putting it together. I think I know who we're going to add next, and so on and so forth. I think I finally figured it out. You know, we'll see. I'm planning ahead. I just want to make sure we have a really strong team, and I think we'll actually come up with a really good one. All right, where the heck am I? Am I getting close to the exit yet, or what battle? Ah, uh, yep, I think we're definitely getting near there. Uh, when you start seeing the green ladies, I think it's where the entrance is coming up. So we should be pretty freaking close. I don't we have I don't think we have that many battles left. Let's just keep Oh, I forgot to use Repel. Of course, let me guess. A Zubat! How cool would it have been if it would have been a shiny Zubat? Sometimes I think like the one time that I don't use the Repel is when we're gonna see a shiny. That would be pretty freaking cool, actually. Sometimes I'm scared though I'll see a shiny while I'm training in the grass. That would kind of suck. I mean, I think that's happened to me before, so ah, who knows? All right, we have another battle. All right, let's keep on moving then. I think it's near this area. I think we have one more ladder to find. I'm not sure where it is. I think it's somewhere around here. Where the heck am I going? I always get lost around these parts. Battle.
Okay, there we have it. I think this is the last ladder leading to where we need to go. And if I'm correct, we're, we can skip around the rest of the battles. Maybe there's like one left. But we should pretty much be in the clear to head out of this freaking cave, which I know has been... Uh, a lot of battling at least we got a lot of experience our Pokemon are all pretty much 25 So going to the next gym, we should be looking pretty strong, which is pretty exciting You know, I think it'll be good for us to do that. We have another battle There we have it guys with that we are pretty much ready to make our way out of here now i just need to find the exit there we go guys we have finished the rock tunnel i know it was stressful it's a long tunnel so many battles but it's good experience next time we will continue from this point because we have arrived in lavender town uh so if you guys have any tips on what we should do here in lavender town let me know thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next episode goodbye